and welcome back to the shitstorm before the great calm. Well, actually knowing this game there will be no calm ever, but... It sure is a shitstorm right now. <laughs> no camel, sorry, we, 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 we actually are full right now, our hotel is full. Right, 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 right. Uh, let me take stock of what we have here, because weird things, weird things we have. So, here's the steel that we will obviously allow, the wood we also want, actually hold this urgently for the purpose of cooking and stuff, some animus box died, unfortunate. We have a cleaver, I think that's good for cooking, yeah, let's hold that. Battle axe, that should have a, long, a big pen. It doesn't actually. So Tasmin has actually put on some new dress. Good for her. Actually, let me set her to do useful things and then we will take stock of the weapons and all of that. We don't have... Oh my goodness, we need... This is disgusting. This is absolutely disgusting, but I have to make a stockpile in this... Um, in this room <laughs> because we don't have even any place to hold the things to we need to build we need to start doing stone cutting and you know what finally we will be able to start doing something because we will have people and it's going to be grand okay so she gave right acute her to um, feed people i've done it yesterday so i don't forget so she's doing that and after that, I will let her take care of herself. Actually, you know what? Take care of yourself first. A broken doctor doesn't keep anyone alive. After that, feed him. Cho, very hungry, feed Cho. And feed Chaos. And then clean this room. She will be a little bit happier once she eats. I mean, she's still pretty happy because of her bloodlust. This is such a valuable trait when it comes to preventing uh, breaking after a raid. That is absolutely very strong. She has four good traits and, well, this one doesn't matter right now. It just gives her mood, actually, mood penalty. It will actually give her mood boost later, much later, so I suppose that's a garbage trait for now, but just a, just a tiny bit. But she has those three traits that are actually really helpful. Especially the Master Medical Immunity. Huge. Okay, so we certainly want the gun. Uh, it's a poor hammer. We, could, we will be able to build a better hammer and probably even find one. Oh, those grenades, I don't think I care. I mean, hold them, we can sell them or dismantle them. Also, hold the wood so we have something to cook with. Uh, the tech prints allow, allow, and actually, after you've done all of that, apply both of them because they are raising our wealth. Look at this, we jumped so high and we don't have any defenses to speak for it. So, let's at least apply the tech prints. We have mead. I would like to hold this because... Oh, we have a charge pistol. It has a terrible range. Apron. It's not a great quality, but it's an apron. Hold it. Uh, these are almost broken. Duke. Sure, handgun. Don't hold this. Leave this out. 83. Hold. Hold. Ah, uh, sure. Get this as well. This is 66. This forbid. These are fine. Uh, some things our guys will have from this. Be able to use. 66. I don't think it's worth it. <clears throat> we also have a chain shotgun. We have a hand cannon. It's poor. Uh, don't bring it. Actually... We could bring it and then sell it. Oh, I'm gonna sneeze. Yep, that was a big sneeze. <laughs> okay. Another chain shotgun, normal. 
We will have to caravan and get rid of some of the stuff, I think. Sell it. I'll take the guns, unless we get a caravan that will help us. What else? So you're pretty tired and lack recreation. I'm gonna make double sure everyone is actually uh, fed and not dying. Okay, so could use a little bit of treatment. After that, prioritize holding this, then clean this up. Clean bed bomb. And tend, tend to everyone. She's getting better now, the plague is going off, going away, sorry. It is 43% now, so she's starting to get her manipulation back and everything, everything will start looking up. We applied the tech prints, so our wealth will actually be dropping quite a bit. Are you serious? No. And right here too. Okay, 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 okay. First of all, before I forget, absolutely clear. Grace. No, 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 no. I'm actually going to keep the animals closer at this point. Because they are no longer animals I just don't really care about. They are our, our beloved family. So let me just clear all of this weird area here and I'm going to reset the grace to something more reasonable and then we'll see what the hell just landed. We absolutely cannot deal with it, just forget we're not going to fight that at all. Okay, so considering there's a mechanoid cluster on that side. This is going to be our new grazing area. You guys can enjoy this area. Uh, let's see what the hell we have here. Uh, slugger. Those trees are really <laughs> annoying <laughs> sometimes. I don't see any mortars. This is very weak. This is very weak. Two of those. The only problem here could possibly be this. Does it shoot? I'm not actually sure. Fast insect-like combat mechanoid armed with a vicious sharp blade. It isn't as dangerous as other close-range mechanoids, such as scythers, but they usually appear in greater numbers. Okay, so we, we basically got a scrub, um, scrub cluster. The only problem is the turret. And we have a psychic suppressor for males. We need someone to help us with this. Oh no, <laughs> that has a big range. Hmm. See, this is what um, what this preset is made for. You're allowed to go here. You're allowed to go clean up all of this and stuff. But you are not allowed to go the other way. Uh, let me double check. She should not get anywhere in it, but let's just make sure she doesn't go towards this wall from the wrong side. Well, that's a problem, but I'm gonna save it anyway. <coughs> With 250 mods? Like, we didn't have a crash yet, which is great, but it's never a guarantee, that's why I'm... That's why I tend to save things. Okay, is the, um... It is not going for our door just yet, okay. Maybe we'll have some traders come and help us? It's possible. Okay, that should also help our wealth a little bit. Tech prints, very expensive. And she needs she needs a rest. Let her finish what she started and then rest while we take care 
of whatever else is here. We, we don't get any real loot here because they actually managed to build it. I'm not sure we can use those. We'll claim it later. Not now. <laughs> we don't need more wealth. Although I suppose that's not really that much wealth, is it? Let's see. Can we move it? No. So it's basically just deconstructing. What's this? Uh, whiskey. Yeah, let's hold that. And let's hold all the guns. Uh, hammer, but it's almost broken. We can do without it. Pretty Cerny and Heinz here. But we have one. <laughs> We're good. And now, how much do you need to actually tame? We cannot tame. Could be our um, our mounts. Although, no. You know what? We'll take one of each. We will we'll find like a Pegasi, maybe a unicorn. <laughs> they will be our other mounts. A weird mod the pharmacist because the idea is great but I wouldn't want them to use the best medicine for wounds ever just life-threatening diseases because this is this is very good this is great yeah maybe 20 Cuts, that should help a bit but yeah I wouldn't want to use this on wounds ever but I would definitely want to use it on diseases that are going to last cargo pods what do we have fine bake but absolutely not going for it I mean it's asleep it initiates in 13 days the turret is also asleep you know what Snatch it while we can. This is weird that this one is not sleeping, it's just standing. It opens doors. It's uh, very weak, but very dangerous because of that. And we're gonna merge these actually. Oh, get psionically nuzzled by Animus Fox. How much points is that actually? Oh, we have quite some points now. <laughs> Animal roulette? <laughs> no, not for now. 10 points. Well, that's one raid if we need it. <laughs> I don't think we will be summoning raids anytime soon, let me tell you that much. <clears throat> okay, once she's kinda better, we have to take care of this prison because, my god, it's a dump. Can you guys stop pooping th like that? We will make heavy for bed rolls. Trader. It's exotic goods, so we cannot sell them a ton of our stuff, but still something. So what was this sound? the sound it's like something is hitting walls or something okay let's uh, let's give her a second more to sleep And now let's come trade with this guy. Anything we can get rid of is great. A weapon, weapons merchant would be great. But we're not getting that. 
I mean, we could. We're just not. Uh, we don't have any other neg negotiators, so... There really isn't anything we can sell. Or buy. Fine. Shitty vendor. Yeah, feed them. Animal pot, wild pot. Well, try it. We can afford to. Before the mechanoids are actually awakened and here. Admittedly, it wouldn't hurt if the traders went that way. And yes, I know I could make them using the trading spot, but I'm not gonna be that cheap. Basically, you have this mod trading spot which designates the area they stop at and if I put it here they would go there and fight the magnets but that's, that's really cheap I'm not gonna do that I'm not gonna do that Did you get insect jelly from this thing? Fine bake really helped us, we don't have to cook today. That's really nice. <laughs> Half a point! Amazing. They're not really gonna be in a great mood as long as they live in this dump. We don't have any blocks to live. perfectly honest I'm not sure I'm not sure I'm beginning the prison is what we should be doing right now actually I'm pretty sure it's not we should be working on this thing so let's be smart about it let's do some tree chopping and let's do some building Oh no, we got a bunch of French Bulldog. That's not good. I don't have food for them. But I don't want them to die. We need... We need a trader to save the Bulldogs. I don't want to leave the base right now. So... I think I might use the achievement points to summon a trade caravan, to be honest. Because it's going to be a good while before we can honestly just leave here. The prisoners. Although we can travel with prisoners. It's just a bit dicey, I think they might escape. And we have just Tasman to try and prevent that. You know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna summon the trade caravan. Mm. Not this! Oh, not this crap. Maybe they will buy at least the animals. I wanted like a book, goods trader, something useful. But I think maybe they will buy the dogs, which is the priority. I need to get rid of them and I just don't... I, I don't want to be killing the dogs. They're just dogs. And they just joined us with high hopes of better life, lost in the wilderness. How could I do that? Just turn them into food. I mean, if we were starving, then yeah, but we're not. Okay, we can actually sell them all the dogs. Great. We might actually be able to buy something for it. And it's gonna be, we have four of those, it's gonna be medicine. Two of that. Actually, that's not a lot of medicine, is it? We can get components or advanced components. Advanced is more 
valuable. Just one of them anyway. Okay, that's fine. And the whole urgently this as well. Please don't don't ignore the valuable me um, electrical device uh, component. Whatever, whatever, whatever. <laughs> Brain fart. Uh, funny story. <laughs> I actually had that sneeze and I failed to turn my mic microphone back up after it. So I've recorded like, I don't know, 20 minutes and it was all muted. So I have to trash it. Now I'm not really sure what I've been talking about and what I haven't. So pardon if I repeat myself. I think the last thing that was recorded was uh, the French Bulldogs. So just in case, I don't know what was so I said they are uh, the mechanics have woken up um, Iria's resistance is zero we can start to recruit her everyone's uh, everyone's getting food poisoning because of has uh, doesn't have time to cook and everyone's eating raw lemons and stuff which really shouldn't give them food poisoning other things for sure but not that but sure and well I don't think anything else monumental happened we had some something small like there, there was a bison that came in that was carrying one glitter word medicine uh anything else the galatros which i was talking about how we were absolutely not fighting because i fought it in a previous episode i mean previous playthrough and it absolutely creamed my colony it started throwing some explosive rocks or whatever and i was talking about how uh, there's way too many animals suddenly to feed <laughs> We cannot, absolutely cannot keep up with the simple meals because we don't have meat for them and everything has to be cooked for three of those guys. So we have three, three animals, four prisoners, Tasmin herself trying to, to keep herself alive and it's just not going so great. And then it turned out that my microphone was muted. So, <laughs> so there's also that. But there was no raid, there was no, nothing dramatic happening at all. I mean, honestly, we have history. We had a Sand Wonder, uh, we had a wanderer also that was probably also yeah I even I made a joke there <laughs> it was a pretty good joke that I don't remember anymore and now it's never going to be uh, heard so sad we also had this uh, wild pot join us I think that was also uh, silent and we said sell we sold it for a full 23 dollars so that was great and well that's basically it as you can see not not a lot has been happening right now we're just trying to clean up the mess and build the traps up and get area here so we have someone who can at least help us clean up the prison so because <laughs> even that even that would be a grand help right now seriously we also don't have time to deal with the farms we might run out of food chaos chaos continues but it's it's all right it's all right tasman is holding on she's holding on and that's the most important thing right now as for the wealth it dropped a bit because of those tech prints here you can see tech prints used it's, it's still kind of high for what we have but things are looking up as long as we get to recruit those guys oh 42 percent chance as long as we get to recruit those guys things will be looking up and then probably looking down, but then looking up again. And we lost some food. Good. We are not going to the ruins. No time whatsoever. <laughs> She's talking to Iria. Come on, Iria. We need you. Yes. Okay. Okay. We have two. We have two. Um, I don't want you to uh, use this garbage. Okay, let's take it. Let's take stock. Let's take stock. Ranged. Let's sort it by range. Marksman rifle. You know what? Sounds good to me, kinda. Automatic pistol. Hmm. What's your shooting skill? Nothing. <laughs> I think I'm gonna give her the. Um, This is also not bad, the ghost rifle. Although it does, does have less DPS. 
Well, this one definitely has the best range. Um, no, for now, let's let's give her the the, 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 the pistol. Equip this. And what are you going to be doing for us? You are crafting intellectual artistic, so I don't think you care over much what your sidearm is. Uh, what will we give her as the melee weapon just in case? What do we have here? Hatchets are pretty good. Granite club. I mean, honestly... Plants, nothing. But I think she could help us in the gardens right now. I don't want her cooking, she will just give everyone food poisoning. Oh, this is so broken. No, maybe, maybe just, maybe just take this. Just take this. That's okay. And yeah, you can wear whatever you want. And let's set your priorities. You are going to be crafting intellectual and also kind of like animals, right? So uh, let's copy this, paste this here. Doctor, surgeon, no, this is basic. Um, animals, yeah, you can handle animals. Tasman will not be dealing with that anymore. Train, uh, you will not be training them. I mean, you can train, just not tame right now. <clears throat> Definitely not cooking. Not butchering. Repair, not your thing. Not your thing. Harvest, no, but you can grow. Don't mind. Plant cut, no. Uh, definitely fabrication, machining, smithing. Tasmin will not be tailoring anymore and art as well. Crafting, loading for everyone, delivering, hauling, cleaning, research. It could really used to be, uh, I'm kind of used to Fluffy's work tab, where you can go to from one to nine, like one to six is great. I could really use at least five, <laughs> but it's fine, we'll, we'll be fine. Okay, so she will do some growing for us now. That's all right, because we really need someone to help. Although she's so slow with it. No, you know what? That's a waste of your time. Don't grow. You can clean and stuff. And then once there's nothing to clean, whole machine or whatever, then do research. Okay. That's actually helpful. Moving up in the world. Look, Tatman is sniffing and something is getting done. And there's a cold snap. Of course there's a cold snap. She will deliver resources. Look at that! We can just go and build. This will be... this will get done! Incredible. Thank you, Iria, for existing. And now imagine when we get those as well. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Please exist in inside the actual uh, zone. <laughs> if we lost her right now, that would have been so stupid. Okay, okay. Disaster averted, barely. But averted. She's cleaning everything. And then that happens. Oh no, how many? <laughs> I was... For a second I thought all of this was also them. I mean, it's still bad. But it could be worse. Maybe the mechanoids could help us. That is possible. Animals. Inside. Too bad they came from this side. Alright, so this one is extremely slow. We have to deal with those. These won't be too big. The worst are these black spiders and I think the spellopedes also shoot. Let's hope they go for the mechanoids. Let's see if they do. Because they do not like each other and that could be very helpful. Where are you going? They're going for our animals. Mm. I mean, Lisk is pretty immune to all of that. We could actually probably... She's gonna break anytime soon. I want to give her time to do whatever she wants. Um, 
You can actually try to not rely on Mechanodes and instead rely on Lisk. So we're gonna provide cover. And actually Kitten could help us as well, I think. Um, just go to Grace. Try to not shoot, no, 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 don't shoot that which can hurt this. That could be the black spider stuff here, yeah, that, that one. It's a very good target choice. Lisk, hold on tight. Oh no, Kitten is kind of too aggressive for this. Uh, no, 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 no. Here, 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 here. Mammoth worm, not very dangerous. This is dangerous. Lisk for needing you to tank this, but times are tough. Very, very, very tough. They are, they are starting to shoot at her, that's not good, that's not good. Help. Kitten, help. We have to train him. <laughs> yourself yep 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 oh there's one more ah, it's gonna bleed out i think kitten and lisk can handle this dying spell of heat psychic sooth thank you it will really help area <laughs> she's really not happy with her life right now yeah consume and then um and come here and do this thing yeah, so Spellopede also shoots. Kill it. Uh, finish off. And actually, uh, haul it. Haul all of it. This is good meat. I mean, meat is not good. I mean, it's good for, uh, for Misha and stuff. But the important part is, they have this very strong kind of armor. We want it. <sighs> After that, just butcher. Yeah, that's not just killing everything. It's not good. Um, you know what? <laughs> I've changed my mind. Harvest things first. Um. Let's do it like that before it all dies, because we have so many mouths to feed. This might not be enough. It's not a lot of peace. Order, harvest this one as well. Okay, and now we can... And then... Um, prioritize standing. Area wants to hold some things, that's great. No, 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 no. This, this is not it. This is not it. Uh, corpses. Corpses 
insect corpses and it's not gonna be this this black 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 mammoth worm megalaus they are gonna go here um, I don't know what those dropped they sound interesting so I think that's it good what is it hosting allies what is this eight days won't do any work we could get advanced component <laughs> absolutely not we don't have food we don't have room we don't have anything for it <laughs> one day one day we shall open a little hotel this, today isn't the day Take a moment to look at this snowy jungle. That's pretty cool. You don't see that often. Not at all. Inspired creativity area. That's that's the that's the payoff for her mood <laughs> for her mood woes. She can get that sometimes, but we actually don't have anything we can craft, so it doesn't matter at all. But supplier, yes, we can get rid of some of this garbage we have lying around. Okay, okay, okay. Let me see what weapons we want to keep. We have five guys soon. We want to keep the marksman rifle. We want to keep the ghost rifle. And this is way too short range for us. Grenade launcher? I don't know if it's any good. I'll be honest with you. What else is good with accuracy? We have an, another automatic pistol. I think it's fine. I don't really want to go below the 25 range for now. Maybe in the future when we can actually employ some sort of strategy? <laughs> not right now though, not right now. Okay, let's let those guys approach and let's unload all of this crap on them. Bye, gorilla, bye. Too cold for you, huh? I forgot to sell the alpaca to the exotic goods trader. <laughs> okay. Which one of you is the boss? Or the boss, where is it? I don't see him. <laughs> oh, maybe... No, they don't have to stop to reveal the boss. Where is the uh, yellow question mark? Guys, did you lose your friend somewhere? Who do I trade with? Him. He doesn't. He doesn't announce it. Sneaky. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. I'm gonna do something rather gross and I'm gonna stop our zone everything to sell that crap to them. Yeah, this crap as well. I think I also have, do I have to allow it? I hope I don't have to allow it. gonna delete those zones afterwards is there any other crap that we would want to sell that's just cluttering yes there is in fact okay let's see if we can sell all of this shit oh so good i'm gonna put all of this on sale and then we will think about what we want to actually keep in a second Yes. Okay, ghost rifle we keep. This you can have. So expensive. Take this away. And now... Charge pistol. It's charged, but it's a pistol. It's... It's really not that great. You can actually see the prices of this so much, so much higher <laughs> than other things. Where was that handgun? Not this one. The, the better one. Apparently they are pretty shit. Automatic pistol. 
I guess the grenade launcher is pretty good then, huh? I don't know. The range, though. Ah, uh, sure. Let's keep it. Mm, this is very short ranged. Very short ranged. This is theirs. So we'll keep this, this, and this. It will be enough for now. And as far as the melee weapons go, uh, we can also buy some medicine. Let's. As far as the melee weapons go, definitely not those that are almost falling apart. A hatchet is good. We'll keep the pick pickaxe. We, I don't know. I don't think any of them are actually miners, but let's keep it. A hammer. Let's keep a hammer. Maybe let's keep this hatchet and I wanted one cleaver. Cleaver, cleaver, cleaver. Where was it? Did it just disappear? Or am I just blind? I mean, it's fine either way. Does it help? No, that just plant work speed. Oh, there it is. Steel cleaver. Okay, I think that that's going to do it. We will get a little bit of... Um, a little bit of gold, but we will also get 30 medicine, which is absolutely great. And we got rid of a lot of garbage and we don't have to allow it. That's great. Hold this actually. And nice. We have some space here as well. That's just perfect. But they didn't want to buy any clothes, but that's all right. Next time. We have a Feralisk clutch mother, but I think since we have two people now, it's all right to go and try to fight her. Because if one of them gets... Um... <laughs> if one of them gets targeted by the... Um... Uh, the spider web, then the other one can actually keep attacking. Not to mention we have double the firepower, of course, but I'm mostly scared of the web, so I guess this one doesn't really web it. I'll just try, yeah, it's webbing now. That's okay. I think with two people that's totally fine. Yep. There it is. Iria had a sad wonder, of course she did. She will have those a lot, so it's alright. <laughs> We have a quest called Matt's Secret. There's some kind of threat following him, but he's unwilling to say what it is or when it might follow. I don't... I don't know. For hours. Let me think. Traps not in a great shape. We do have the mechanoids that could help us. And I wouldn't mind some help getting rid of it. I think I'm going to accept it and I'll hope it goes for the mechanoids. And also we will get rid of Matt in just a second and I'm curious if it actually the, the threat will still follow or not. Animals uh, hide in mini grace, thank you. Now we go for science. Let's see if the threat will follow, even though Matt is gone. And then if you could please merge. That would be nice. Oh, this Hillroot is actually still alive. Wow. Respect. <laughs> Or when it might follow, we don't know. Hmm. Okay. Tricky. Oh, can you merge this, please? What do you mean, no stack available to merge into? It goes to 50. Oh, because it was reserved. Alright, alright, makes sense. Well then, 
We shall see what this threat will be and um, yeah. Let's get on this project in that case. <laughs> Very quickly. Seriously, she just walked into the trap and lost an eye. Are you shitting me right now? No, she cannot really... <laughs> Can she not really shoot very well? No. And it's so long since... Oh, until we have bionic eyes. That was so stupid. Come on. <laughs> it was this trap. Because we don't have the door here. Like... You have to have it everywhere. Everywhere. Over here. Okay, game, I got your point. One trap, one door too little. It's one door too little too many. Fuck's <laughs> Okay, so here's what happened. We just had a jungleisk self-tame. I thought it would be like, whatever. I wanted to set him up um, to his area and stuff and then he pulled the mechanoids so now we have mechanoids <laughs> coming for us there he is fighting the dagger snout he actually did pretty well Iria, don't prioritize your fucking club and maybe go that way They will open the door in a second, I think. First of all, we have to handle this guy. Okay. Manticore? Are you serious? Did you just... Did you not just see those mechanoids just die? Stupid or something? This one is weird. I think it's, it's kind of derped. <laughs> he should be coming to open our doors. I don't know what happened to him. Whatever. Screw him. Um, screw him. I will see if uh, there's some errors or whatever, but... Um, I don't know. I hope it's just one time thing that he got derped. Not very consequential, but if they were all getting derped, I would have to see if I don't have to change the mod order or something like that. I guess we'll see in a little bit. Hmm, so it looks like he is bugged. These are not red arrows, so it's nothing too terrible, I guess, but he's kind of stuck. And he's spamming errors in the log. I think we should try to get rid of him. It might be problematic because of the turret, but if we go around... There's also those... Shit, this isn't the wall. Hmm. No, I guess he's gonna, <laughs> he's gonna get to keep spamming his errors for now. Because I don't really know how we should be able to handle that. Oh well. Oh well. Okay, so we have, uh, so we have exotic goods trader. Coming this way, maybe they will handle the, the cluster. That would be very nice if they did that for us. So there's no. Yes. Yep, yep. Go deal with that, please. Thank you. Uh, there is a bugged robot. He has trouble with his brain. Um, like defend yourself? Hello? Hello? Defend yourself? Guys? Don't just ignore your friend being the only one fighting. They are just not very smart either. Come out. Come out. Use this to uh, actually get this shit down. Attack this. Let's say they provided some cover or something. Now please attack this. I know Iria cannot reach. Still shooting at someone else. Use it. Okay, and now attack this bugged robot. <laughs> Did you walk into the fire? No, why are you going? Come on, come back, come back, come back. Uh, 
stabilize this guy. Oh, you attack this. Anyone else we can actually save? No, they're just fucking off. Very unhelpful towards their friends. I'm not gonna lie. We got a PDW. Well, kind of shame they all didn't they? Because it was an exotic goods trader. We would have gotten good stuff. I still take this stuff in. Sure, we might need that for area. And now we can also set the zones to unrestricted. Set up a medical bed. It's gonna be the shittiest medical bed for now. Not going to go down in a second. What is this? Mechanoid component. What? Oh, it's from the Mechanoids faction. Very advanced processors and na nano calculators, most often used in creation of mechanoid tech on our world mechanoid swarm foundries. I don't know what we do with this, but it's deteriorating and I don't like that, so get it all into the base area. Prioritize hauling those things. And also, uh, fight. How are you with the infection? Fine. Okay. Rescue. Oh, no, no, this also, 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 also. Pick it up. Dynamite, I don't think we care about. No storage space for what? For a dead mechanoid. Ah, uh, you know what? <laughs> sure. Go into the freezer. And those two... Into the freezer. Ah, oh, the animals are starving again. Please, butcher. I want to stop cooking for the animals. It takes too much time. I turned off their ability to eat meals. Still the sound. I think it's them just walking over furniture. I don't know. I have no idea. It's the infection, but she's fine. She's alright. Wait, what? She was pregnant! And I didn't notice. Actually, they have to all go to Grace because we had this cold snap and there is nothing to eat here. But what? I did not expect that <laughs> and I didn't notice when when she had a baby well then all right I guess we got two now I was just checking what gender Alex Slayer was but yeah he's male he's not gonna procreate suddenly it's been a while though since we got him so <laughs> well that's a surprise Meteorite shower. What did we get? Sky steel, 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 granite, and rose quartz. Rose quartz is great. It makes such beautiful uh, floors. I mean, it's a shame because we cannot actually pick the floors from here, but they're still very, very red, and that's uh, that's basically great as it is. Even those, uh, even if it, we just have those two to pick from. Well, this one, this one isn't pretty. I wonder, I could probably replace this texture with something I like, why not? I might do that one day. Actually what the hell happened here? I mean we had the siege, oh because they, oh I just dismantled the catapult. I think the chunks are here, I was just so overwhelmed by this raid, I didn't notice they had all those chunks here and i think that was basically their ammunition for shooting that that's pretty cool actually i love it so they just bring a ton of random stone chunks 
that's really fun. So we have some more rose quartz, we have mudstones, and we have even hardened slime. <laughs> okay, so this uh, dismantling those things actually gave us a lot of wood, that's great, we'll have it for the traps. So that's nice. Yep, they'll build some traps. Let's see if the ghost rifle. How are the prisoners? Let's do a little bit of a check. Uh, 27 ages away, 22, 23 ages away. How's the sound? Oh. Division Omega. He was supposed to marry, Madhead finally admitted what he was fleeing from. He was supposed to marry the child of Keiko Thomas, the leader of Division Omega. He became drunk before the ceremony and vomited on the altar. A flagrant insult towards Thomas's whole family. Well, yeah. <laughs> oh no, they'll uh, avoid your turret fields and notice some of your traps. And this is the, the, probably the most difficult faction we have in the game. Oh, and they are dropping right on top of us. Well, you failed to mention that. Dude, how could you fail to mention that? That's kind of... Hold this open. They will avoid... Um, and go... No, no, go this way, this way, this way. And this door do not hold open. This door do not hold open. Let's hope they steal. Bitch. Do you have Galvan knuckles and you have... Don't shoot Tom. I know he's an idiot, but still. Where are you gonna go with that? I hope they go this way and grab some traps. I also think they cannot shoot us when they are carrying stuff, so... Oh, now I wish they would, wouldn't go through the traps, actually. They do nothing to them. Oh my god. We need a better defense system. If they weren't stealing this crap... We would be dead, I think. Get, 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 get. You guys are mechano mechanoid components. I want them. Okay, great. Uh, what do they have? A flag vest? Great, strip him. And void helmet. That's good. Nice. And you, what did you have? Trooper armor, which is 53%, but I, uh, Tasman can use some of it. Um, Karambit. Hold everything, just hold everything and hold my components back. And now she broke again. She was just broken. Oh no, wait, that's later. I just left it because it was off screen so <laughs> to show what happened. Okay, I thought she just broke again. Oh no, she's actually doing just fine. All right, well, that was chaotic. So apparently Stomp has died of malnutrition and honestly, I forgot he existed. So I guess that's a little bit on me, but also... No, I guess he doesn't just eat random stuff. Yeah, that's on me. I'm sorry, Stomp. Let's build you a grave. Like a proper one. Here. Although, nah. I mean, what did he do? He was just... He was just so stupid. An idiot all around. He didn't make friends with anyone, he just... Although... His friends did leave him to die. Okay, okay. I mean, he was clearly not loved in life, so at least let's give him some peace. Some peace in death. Well, that's gonna be area breaking, probably. <laughs> let's give Stomp a little bit of peace. Could you build this grave, please, and bury him before prioritize burying? Ah, stupid stone. 
Is it a garden or is it a graveyard? Isn't that going to be a very, very important question? Bulk guts, goods, yeah, 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 yeah. We might be able to unload some more crap, especially the clothes we don't really need. I don't know what they would want to wear, but that's not going to be my concern right now. We can always make some clothes for them later. Let's see what they've got. And we have slave transfer. I thought it was something more interesting. Animal trust swarming. Called Rotten. He's gonna be fine. Uh, no. He looks fine. Just the conditions not even bleeding out. He'll be up in no time. Okay, we can finally sell the alpaca. Sell the alpaca. Everything else we want. <laughs> they don't even want to buy kitten. If we wanted to sell kitten, it's just too scary for them. And they don't want to uh, buy our deer either. Okay, so let's... Uh, I kind of like this crown. I'm gonna keep it. This looks pretty good. But the tooks can go. Lizard skin pants, they are in very good condition. Aprons. Aprons I'm gonna keep. This is excellent. Let's keep it. And all of this crap can actually go. Wake up powder. Crushed and powdered form of wake up, surprisingly sweet and sometimes used as replacement for sugar in desserts dissolved in or dissolved into a morning espresso. Provides a very diluted version of the drug without risk of addictions. That's actually not half bad. That's 79. Yeah, that's fine. Those are 90% and they are good. We, we can keep the gloves. Okay, someone will certainly be happy to use them. Now, when it comes to leathers, I'm sure we should get rid of some of it. Light leather, pig skin, not very useful to us. Uh, insect chitin, not a big fan. Panthera, heavy fur, of course, we keep. Arctic lion, pretty. This is useful, useful. This I don't really care about. This we don't have nearly enough about uh, of to make it worth, well, worth anything. Tiger leather is fine. I'm wondering the plain leather. Not the biggest fan of that. And since they don't have money for it, we can instead buy some... We don't really need food, do we? We could buy some more Nutramen. We will... Def How much of it do we have? None? Oh, maybe. <laughs> maybe it got destroyed. Yeah, let's get some Nutramen. Because we really want the medicine production at some point. And it would appear that whatever Nutramen we had was destroyed somewhere along the way. Things happen. Especially when you have your storage in the middle of your room where you sometimes throw grenades, <laughs> I suppose. Yeah. Uh, please hold this urgently. Look how clean the place is now that we have to... Oh. Why didn't we butcher this? I trusted them to know what they are doing. They betrayed my trust. Uh, we have some milk. Oh, we're really getting low on food, aren't we? Kinda, yeah. We need those guys. We need them. It's 20 per... Uh, 20, 21, 18. She's in the teens now. We can get chaos soon-ish. Really. Uh, the catapults helped us with the traps, but as we could see. It was absolutely useless versus anything that has any sort of armor. And the fact that we can get raided by Division Omega is not a good fact. Unless we always let them steal something <laughs> and then try to fight them. <laughs> but that was very fortunate. I didn't get around to building a better jail because I just don't have anything from... I'm not gonna build it out of wood. I'm just not gonna. Heavy magical leather medicine bag. What does it do? It's from Dove's Rim Kit. Allows the wearer to treat their own injuries or others without the need for beds, but not perform surgery. 
all also increases healing speed. We can, well, we can use uh, the stabilize mod obviously for treating without the need of bed, but it's very useful that she will be able to stand faster in such situations. Such, such situations. So absolutely good thing. Who's starving? Oh my god, everyone's starving again. Because we don't have meat, because someone uh, didn't actually butcher the elephant that we brought to base. A sec, it's like a curtain kindergarten here. We just have to micromanage everything. We need more people, like, so very much. But at least we have prospects now. Admittedly, those people here are the reason we need more people so very much, but still. <laughs> My point stands. So we've got uh, another wandering that was kicked out and we have a quest lonesome prisoner do we get anything great for it no uh, keep him a prisoner for 13 days i don't know i don't think so <laughs> we are probably due for a prison break anyway i don't know what it actually means mm, ah yeah between prison break attempts I guess Cho is not really into uh, prison breaks. Let's see. Let's see how it, how this goes. Thirteen point four, getting there, getting there. Slowly, slowly but surely. Like one more quadrum, and we will have an actual colony here. <laughs> Another boar rider. <laughs> You guys and your pores, seriously. <laughs> I just wanted to trade with people. I just wanted to trade with people. And then there is this. What is it this time? Smoke spewer. Auto charge turret. And mech assembler creating fireworms. We have one of those, Goomlight and Aura. The mix, not the biggest issue. This, the biggest issue. Fuck's sake. Um, <laughs> GTFO, not going there. Just forget this area exists. Forget this area exists. It doesn't, there's nothing there. Let's give them some room to go here, I suppose. They can go back home. And there's really no need to go anywhere farther than that for now. And let's not forget. Let's not forget to do this. <laughs> and you know what? I think this is going to be it for this episode. Truly, really truly. Okay, but well, we cannot say it's been uh, boring anymore with Perry. <laughs> he doesn't sleep, never sleeps. Okay, so what the else do we have here? Uh, anything we, uh, smoke grenades we can sell. The pants and the rest is I think the things we elected to keep. Some medicine, yeah, sure. I'm for it. Survival meals, I think will be fun. We are actually starting to bring some meat by scavenging and all that, but now this whole whole area too dangerous. We have a bit of meat and well, we're not dying of hunger just yet. The peas are growing. We should be all right, but yeah, we are we are behind on the gardens and we don't need the heal root, but also it wouldn't hurt to have a bit more. I don't think it would. What did they give us? Chitin. I don't want it. Uh, sell it. Sell it right back to them. No, no, no. Stay. Chitin. I cannot sell it. I can sell them my gas mask. I don't need it right now. Fine. I'll take your chitin. Okay, well, um, this is at the end of this episode. Thank you for watching. 
And in the next episode, I think we'll start to get some prisoners and then, then everything will really speed up because we will get someone on uh, the blocks, we will get Iria on research, we will get Cho on cooking because he's a good cook, he's a um, cannibal, charismatic, he's very, he's, he's very pleasant, he just wants to eat you at the same time. But other than that, an absolute delight. He, yeah, he's social, he likes to heal people so that they, he can eat them later. <laughs> we have Chaos, she's good at shooting and melee, she's basically a competent. She is also very a competent crafter. She is staggeringly ugly, so she will probably have some troubles in colony. But, uh, and also she really, she will really get bitchy if we don't complete any quests or go outside or do anything like that. But she's also a sanguine and she's a glutton. She's, she's alright, but she can be causing troubles due to being, being staggeringly ugly. And, <clears throat> sorry, no one will like her because everyone in Rimworld is extremely shallow. And Ashen, he's, he really likes construct things, uh, but he cannot do that at all, so he'll need a bit of training. Okay, sorry. Oh, jungle, wait, 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 I'm just trying to talk about the people, stop it, game. He's good at shooting, he needs training and construction. He's going to find his way, uh, probably building traps or whatever. I guess he's also a pessimist, so he and Iria will get to talk around, uh, talk together about how terrible, terrible life is. And now my poor, um, poor animals are getting um, hunted by stupid junglesks. So, and mechs are assembling in minus twenty seconds. What does that mean? Maybe because it's asleep? Or is it broken? I'll find out and I'll get back to you in the next episode. Bye.